Meg. No, we don't have to tell you that getting kids back into routine after summer break can be challenging, but we did speak to a scientist at the Salk Institute who says it's all about being consistent with that regular routine. We don't work like a light switch, so you can't just say it's time to go to bed after just eating and running around and expect someone to fall asleep. So a lot of it's preparing yourself for the best sleep you can get. So dimming lights, calming down kind of mentally and physically, um, and making sure you're eating at regular times as well. That can actually have a big impact on your sleep. If you're having a really big, heavy meal right before you go to, go, go to bed, it's going to be a lot harder to fall asleep and get a good quality sleep. And if you had a nice meal, you have an hour to three hours for your body to kind of calm down, and then your body's able to rest. Well, the doctor says, don't forget, if kids don't get enough sleep, it's more difficult for them to concentrate, which means their grades could suffer. And there are physical effects as well, like digestive issues and headaches. Okay, well.